So today we're going to look at the uh, reading a Bohr model of the hydrogen atom. Now Bohr's model was all based on hydrogen, and which is why it's no, no longer the atomic theory that we use today, because it was only good for hydrogen. <clears throat> but we can get some good information out of the one um, that he came up with this, with hydrogen. And so when you add energy to an atom, the electrons get excited. <clears throat> and when they get excited, they move up an energy level. So they go from a lower energy level to a higher energy level. <clears throat> when electrons return to the ground state or fall back down, they release energy. And they release this energy in the form of light. <clears throat> okay, and so if you look in your reference packet, you will see a picture of a, the Bohr model for the hydrogen atom. <clears throat> and in it, you will see the different energy levels, okay, and these dots represent the electrons, where the electron starts, and the arrow represents where the electron ends. <clears throat> and so, basically, these electrons out here are excited, the arrow points to their ground state, when they fall back down, and then if we follow the line up to this picture of the spectrum here, it will show us what type of light is emitted. Now, when we talk about light, it's not just visible light. We're talking about light, any type of light from the electromagnetic spectrum. <coughs> so let's look at this example. What's the wavelength of light that is emitted when an electron moves from n equals 3 to n equals 1? So we find the dot on n equals 3 that has an arrow pointing to n equals 1, and we find it to be right here. And then we follow the line down, and it tells us the wavelength is 103. <coughs> now, 103 what? Well, right here it tells us it's measured in nanometers. So this is 103 nanometers. What type of light is that? Well, that's UV, and UV stands for ultraviolet. <clears throat> All right, so you try the next one. What is the wavelength of light emitted when an electron moves from energy level 2 to energy level 1? What's the wavelength? What kind of light is that? All right, so energy level 2, find the electron on it, is the arrow going to 1, and we follow the line back, and that's 122 nanometers, and again, ultraviolet light. 